Hi, I'm Stu. Welcome back to another LumaFusion video tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you a technique that allows you to blur and blend between two different video clips. And I want to visually tie them together. So let's get started. We're going to go to the end of the first clip and you can just see the girl swimming appearing. We will swipe once to the left and that takes us to the last frame of the first clip and then gonna take a screenshot so tap on export we can then go into our photos i'm going to bring that snapshot back in and you want to place it so that it aligns with the first frame of the second clip and then just stretch it out so that it covers the whole of the second clip what we then want to do is go into our little pencil icon and first of all go to our color and effects tap on our blurs and then i'm going to start off with a gaussian blur of 80 but i think i might just slacken it down a little bit and we'll take it down to 55 i'm thinking and there we go we're then going to go over to our frame and fit i'm going to scroll down to blending change the blending mode to either overlay or soft light if you want quite a strong color effect go for overlay if you want something a little bit more subtle go for soft light let's see how overlay looks i kind of like that to be honest with you the one thing you can do at this stage if you wish is if you go into your size and position you can play about with the actual color and position i'll probably go for a bit there you can increase or reduce the opacity a little bit just a, bit, a little bit more subtle and you'll see now when we go from our silhouette aura into our girl dancing we're bringing across the cinematic color scheme of the first clip and blending it with the second clip so for the dynamic version of this technique we're going to take our first clip and we're going to duplicate it we're then going to drag the whole clip across and above our dancing underwater girl then from there again you're going to go into color and effects blurs and we'll go for an 80 blur this time and then maybe just lower it down to around about 60 odd then go into our frame and fit down to blending change the blend mode once again to either soft light or overlay so soft light looks like this overlays a little bit more saturated and contrasty i like overlay you can maybe reduce the opacity just a little bit just to take the edge off of it it visually ties the second clip and with the first clip giving you a much more cinematic look in general hope you've enjoyed the video tutorial today if so feel free to share it with family and friends and i will catch you on the next one see you later i suppose Beneath the glow of northern lights Mermaid heart dancing in the deep Aurora waves painting the sea